City Farmer News hanging out at the Mason Bee Hive. Well, it's not really a hive, but it's where we have a whole bunch of different types of Mason Bee houses. And um, pretty much Mason Bees need sort of a tube-like hole. And we've got a couple of different things we've designed. Um, there's the bamboo. There's just an old hollowed out uh, plant stem. We've got holes drilled into just a piece of wood and we've got some routed bits and then we've got these lovely houses built by a company, a local company called Be Diverse and it's so fabulous because these observation nests you can actually take and open up and see what the mason bees have been doing and you, as you can see they are really busy and you've got all the little um, inside of what's going on in those tubes which is the little tiny masonry sort of walls that they construct out of clay they collect the collection of all the pollen which you can see is that bright yellow stuff which is um, what they're collecting out right now and what's blooming right now in the end of April and May and then you can see the little tiny egg and as we get further along into the summer you'll see this egg hatch and um, start to feed on the pollen and eventually will pupate until next spring we get our new adults and I have a feeling that just from how busy they've been this year they are going to be super busy next year because almost every single one of these little homes has been filled by a mason bee out collecting pollen from our lovely gardens and pollinating our apple trees and plum trees and cherry trees and um, they're just a fabulous native pollinator. And look at this little guy, just sort of hanging out. They're sort of slow, it's pretty early in the morning and they're kind of slow until it gets warm. The south facing overhang that we have the houses on and they are just loving it here. And you can see this little guy just kind of poking its head out or a little girl right out of the hole there, just covered in pollen out there to make big luscious juicy apples from your garden.